What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I posted. Today, we got Paul Macbeth's new grip lineup with his travel bag and of course his disc golf bag. Shout out to uh, Dynamic Iron City for letting me pre-order and making it easy where I could just get it on the day of release. Um, didn't have to pay for shipping or anything. Um, and I'd like to shout out my sponsor, between the Pines, make sure you check out their online store and use the code SEAN, S-E-A-N, in all cap, to get 15% off. All right, enjoy the video. All right, guys. Here's the new grip bag from Paul Macbeth. And, man, it is so nice. You got two compartments right here. You can put your shoes, another pair of shoes, backup shoes, I guess. And then there's a zipper on the side. Zipper on the side, and then zipper up front. And there's actually Velcro here. There's just a lot of, a lot of hidden compartment. Another one right here, and then I mean, look how. I forgot how many discs they said you can put in here. Maybe 40, but I'll fill it up um, and show it to y'all. But there's this tab right here. You can open it up and it has the straps. And let's see, there's something else in here. Yeah, there you go. You got the Paul Macbeth grip tag and then just extra, uh, well, yeah, extra tabs if you want oh, the red color instead of all black. But yeah, let's fill this bad boy up and see what we got. All right, so I filled the bag up. These are all fairway drivers. Um, I was able to fit comfortably 26 discs. And you can, I mean, that's with a pair of shoes on each side. So um, yeah, it holds a lot of discs. I was kind of expecting it to hold more. Um, I don't know what they advertise, but um, yeah, I try to fit. 27 but it was kind of hard to pull the disc out but yeah it's an awesome travel bag um for sure gonna use it maybe half disc and then half clothes for backup when i you know when, when i go to tournaments and stuff out of town but um yeah the quality is just really nice and yeah i'm excited for it all right guys what everyone's been waiting for the new paul Macbeth bag and man, it's a big bag, but um, it's very light. And I love, the main reason why I got it is you got the low cut that, you know, that's the major change right here compared to, here's the original or the old one. Got the high, yeah, they fixed this. People have been having a really hard time taking the disc out. And um, I know the, you know, they released another one that they kept the side pockets, but I actually like the different compartment. Um, I'm gonna test it out where if I can really fit a hoodie in these pockets, but but uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to put it in there. Hopefully it does because that's, you know, that's really what I want especially with these side storages. Um, probably put bug spray and sunscreen and all that. But um, yeah, uh, the bag came with the ESP Kratos. Man, that is, that's pretty sick. Um, and it also comes with, let's see here. Same thing with the travel bag. Got the red zipper poles. Um, Got this mini, which is really nice. And yeah, let's see what else. It comes with the red grip for uh, the patches. I think that's, no, there's, there's another one. Oh, and this grip tag, which is pretty cool. But yeah, let's see right here. See, this is what I was really looking forward to right here. I can just put my, um, Push now in here. I mean, I'm not glad I barely use the range finder, 
And we got right there. And this is what really, they got two sleeves in the back, which I really like uh, for the umbrella and ones for this retriever. But yeah, even um, the umbrella thing, it has adjustable, um, what you call it? Adjustable latch, so you could really tighten it. Um, and then you got the side pockets, water, adjustable as well. Adjustable as well. And I know they did something with uh, the cushion or something. And, oh, hey, look at that. They even have <laughs> a pocket right there, which is awesome. And, um, yeah, I really like the mini marker here. Let me see if I can find one. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Shout out to the judges for the sick mini. Let's see if it fits. This might be too big. There we go. And it fits just like that. Hopefully it doesn't fall off. I don't think it will. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put some discs in there. I know they say you can fit five in the putter pocket. Uh, I've seen some people put this in here. I know you can fit two and I want to say you could probably put 21 in the main compartment. But also I'm going to put the putty, uh, uh, put the hoodie in there and I'll let y'all know if I can actually fit it in here or not. I know you can um, expand the pocket and man, these are really nice. It just makes it that much easy. But all right, all right. Here's it loaded. I got, I got 21 with three mid range. Um, it's kind of tight. I might take, I mean, you know, I might switch it to 20, but I mean, it's still you can just easily get in and out. And honestly, I could put another one in this bag, but um, yeah, got five. Putters with a zone in there, so five fits pretty good in here. Nice and easy, accessible. Um, now, the, the question is, can you fit a hoodie in here? And yes, you can. It's actually, it wasn't bad. Oh, I might bring glass here, but this this pocket really surprised me how how much it expands. I mean, once you get the zipper all the way all the way back here, I mean, you can definitely fit a hoodie and rain jacket, whatever you want on the other side. Um, the bag is kind of getting heavy now with it, with the loaded up, but um, yeah, it feels great. So on the back side, y'all can see. I mean giant i probably won't be taking a bottle this big but it can easily fit that and on the other side and um the padding is just so nice and it fits really good to my back and i think just over time it'll just mold to my back um but yeah that's the review guys hope you enjoy hope this helps